Sparkle, sparkle. Hey everybody and welcome to another episode of Crafting Like a Boss with Livy Ross and today we're doing a very, very quick and easy Valentine's Day craft using a wine bottle. I wanted something to go along with the love sign I made a few weeks ago so this was perfect and easy and quick so that's what we're making today. Things you're going to need are some red spray paint, uh, just some fake flour you can pick up anywhere, some puffy paint, some pink yarn, and a wine bottle or a beer bottle or whatever you want to use. Uh, I also have polyurethane in the picture. I ended up not needing it because I, the spray paint was glossy, but you might want to pick some up if you have you know, a flatter paint or if it's just not as shiny as you want. So pick those things up. We're going to start off by finding a nice empty spot on our wine bottle here and take your puffy paint and make a heart shape right on that empty spot of the bottle. Try to make it nice and center and make it as big as you want, small as you want, whatever size fits you. Alright, so then lay it on its side, make sure it's not going to roll over and get all over your floor. Uh, you want to lay it down flat like this for it to dry though so the puffy paint doesn't drip. So let that dry. You want to do this part early in the day because it takes a long time for puffy paint to dry, especially onto a glass bottle. <clears throat> so go ahead and do that. Once that's dried, take your red spray paint and spray the entire bottle. And once that's dry, you want to take your pink yarn and tie a knot on the back of the neck of the bottle. And then take your yarn and go all the way, just wrap it around the whole neck of the bottle, all the way to the top. Then tie another knot on the back again at the top of the bottle. Top it off with your favorite flower and put it right beside the love art I made a few weeks ago. And looky there, nice and complete, pretty easy today. Uh, something nice and quick just to finish off my Valentine's Day decor here. Um, any questions, go ahead and leave them in the comments section. If you have any ideas of something else you want to see made or any questions of any kind of craft you've ever had and you think I might know the answer, go ahead and leave that in the comments. But as always, like, rate, subscribe, and have a good day.